Chapter 12, Treatment of the Hair and Scalp. The main purpose of a shampoo is to cleanse the hair and scalp. Shampoo products should be selected according to the condition of the client's hair and scalp. The condition of the hair and scalp is most influenced by shampoo products, acidity or alkalinity. Solutions that shrink, constrict, and harden the cuticle scales usually have an acidic pH level. Solutions that soften, swell, or expand the cuticle scales usually have an alkaline pH level. Shampoo products are usually manufactured in the form of emulsions. The usual pH range of shampoos is 4.5 to 7.5. The two main ingredients in a shampoo product are water and surfacants. The portion of the shampoo molecule that attracts water and repels dirt is the head. The portion of the shampoo molecule that attracts dirt and repels water is the tail. Base detergents of shampoos include anionics, cationics, and non-ionics. An anionic surfacant that is used to create a milder shampoo is sodium lauryl sulfate. Cocomide is a widely used non-ionic surfacant. Surfacants that may be included in dandruff shampoos are usually cationic. A type of surfacant that is used in several baby shampoos is most likely an ampholite. The type of shampoo that is very effective in reducing dandruff is the therapeutic medicated shampoo. A shampoo formulated to prevent the stripping of permanent hair color from hair is an acid balanced shampoo. Shampoos that are designed for oily hair and scalp are often balancing shampoos. Shampoo products designed to cut through product buildup are usually clarifying shampoos. Mild cream shampoos that contain humectants are known as moisturizing shampoos. Special chemical agents designed to deposit protein or moisture in the hair are conditioners. The, the basic types of conditioners include instant, treatment or repair, and leave-in. Finishing, detangling, and cream rinses are examples of instant conditioners. Conditioners that draw moisture into the hair with chemical compounds are called moisturizing conditioners. Conditioners that penetrate the cortex to replace lost keratin are protein conditioners. Concentrated protein in a heavy cream-based moisturizer is usually a deep conditioner. Leave-in conditioners should not be rinsed out may be used with thermal tools and help to equalize porosity. Rinses that are formulated to control minor dandruff and scalp conditions are medicated rinses. A rinse designed to counteract yellowish or dull gray tones in the hair is a bluing rinse. A cosmetic solution that can stimulate the scalp, correct the scalp condition, or be used as a grooming aid is a hair tonic. The usual pH range of hair conditioners is 3.0 to 5.5. Shampoo and hair cutting capes are two types of drapes. Nylon, cotton, or synthetic hair cutting capes are preferable because they shed wet or dry hair more effectively. The purpose of a towel or neck strip between the drape and a client's skin is to maintain sanitation standards, conform to state barber laws, and to prevent drape contact with the client's skin.